Hey guys, subscribe for daily content. And if you're shopping for gear, make sure you check out the description for the newest items at some of the very best online retailers. There's also links for some of the items that I personally recommend. Thanks. What's going on YouTube? Metal Complex here. And uh, today I've got another short little unboxing to share with you guys. Actually, it's probably not gonna be short because there's four items here and I don't even know what this is. Thanks so much to my generous patrons who are supporting me right now. There's a link for Patreon right down below. And please make sure to follow me on Instagram at metal underscore complex. So, uh, Damn Designs sent me uh, four, looks like four knives. I've not been in here yet. I've taken these out of the initial box, but I've not been in here yet. And I, I have no idea what that is. So I think the first thing we're gonna open is this. Uh, it doesn't feel like a knife. So let's find out what is going on here. <laughs> what is this? Milk uh, I'll <laughs> white. <laughs> I don't understand. What what is this? There's two of them. Are they beads? Oh, 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 okay. Alright, well cool. All right, there's one. Is this Pac-Man? <laughs> Oh my gosh, I love it. That's great. <laughs> I, I the you know there's some irony here because I I don't like lanyards at all. But I am fascinated with like just kind of funny um lanyard beads, right? This is a, a crazy thing to hang off of your knife, but it's funny. Got milk, right? Yeah. That's cool. All right. My son will love this. My son Loves two things right now. <laughs> he loves Pac-Man and Sonic the Hedgehog. So that will um, definitely make him happy. <laughs> I should drill a hole in his little plastic pretend pocket knife and make a lanyard so that he can hang that off the back of it. Anyways, um, let's take a look at some of these. So first up we have uh, Wandy. Win oh, probably win maybe Windigo. When, Wendigo? I don't know. Let's get in here. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm going to have to open this up here real quick. You know what I realized? I used this to open a package. <laughs> I used a different knife to open something on an unbox. I have done hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of uploads not bro breaking the streak of using this. It was bound to happen eventually. Okay, let's open this up, take a look. So I've got a bunch of these, um, well, that's, I like the uh, kind of the darker acid wash. Um, I still have a bunch of these over to the right and uh, I, I have not done videos on them yet, but I will probably group some of them together uh, and either do one big video or just a couple uh, videos because there are a lot of these uh, designs and they are fairly similar. The action's very good. It's it's exactly what I would expect um, for uh, you, you know a knife of this caliber, but it's much better than it was in the beginning. Ooh, fourteen C twenty eight N. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, I don't know how much these are. You'll have to check it out on the uh, Damn Designs website, which I will link down in the description along with some of the other uh, retailers that I generally recommend. So this one here, sorry, is uh, the Banshee and it's Vader themed, okay? Let's see, let's get in here real quick. I don't know that I've seen this one. Can you? Yeah, you can, just barely get at it. That's a thick, oh man. Very, uh, kind of a chunky snub nosed blade. Uh, 14C28N again. We're looking at bearings and decent flipping action there. Pretty good flipping action, actually. And you can get your fingernail just barely underneath that slot right there to kick it out. I think actually it works better using the meat of my finger. So, yeah, okay. Nice clip there. Very ultra, ultra deep carry clip. Got the same on this guy. Yeah, they're both. The only thing you're going to see is the, um, the clip itself. Okay, cool. These two here, uh, this one is a Basilisk Stormtrooper theme, all right. Another one that's white, and but this one's black. Uh, the blade is black anyway. And 
What do we have here? Okay, cool. I remember this one. Uh, once again, 14C28N. Nice. Uh, nothing much to complain about there. This is not a review, guys. Even though I have technically handled these knives or these models before, except for this guy. This is just an unboxing and first impressions. The video or videos that are coming on these knives, uh, the full comprehensive review or discussion, probably combination, will come a few weeks down the road. This last one here is Vocas something. Uh, hmm. Well, I'm sure that it'll be on the website. Some of them are on the side of the box and some of them are not. Let's get in here real quick. And there we go. Okay, aggressive Tanto with a little harpoon notch. That's kind of cool. A lot of the handle shapes are very, very similar, right? I mean, this is a good, it's a countersunk liner lock, running on bearings, captive pivot, minimal hardware, right? In fact, unbelievably minimal hardware. How is this all even being screwed together? Are the screws underneath? <laughs> yeah, um, really straightforward, but good design. I'm going to guess that these guys are not horribly expensive. I don't know. 14C28N can kind of get that price up there. If you don't know, 14C28N is one of the very best budget steels in existence. It's one of the best steels that you can get on a budget knife. It is stainless. It is tough. It'll hold a reasonable edge, but it's very easy to sharpen. It is very, very, very sought after for um, a good budget knife. So uh, you'll have to check out his website to get the prices on this. Like I said, when I do the video, I will probably group a lot of these together. We have very similar handle shapes. In the case of these two, the handle shape is identical. Yeah. And then the blade shape is different. Same thing with these guys over here. We're looking at identical handle shapes and just a different blade, as far as I can tell. Yeah, they're literally identical. So um, we'll probably do like a grouping, but he's got, it looks like we've got like different additions, different versions. Of this. And it looks good. The YG10 looks good. That stuff is definitely going to um, get dirtied up very easily. The other, the, the nice thing about YG10 though is if it does, you can just dye it whatever color you want using the RIT dye. Uh, it's pretty easy to do and it's not expensive. I really actually need to do that on this channel uh, just to demonstrate it or to, you know, just do it for myself once. But like YG10 is going to pick up like dirt and probably hand oil, stuff like that really, really fast. Um, so yeah, it looks good though. And all of these function really well. The detent's good. These guys with the thicker blades, Definitely, you know, gravity helping uh, those blades fall shut uh, a little bit easier, I think. Yeah, these are, that's essentially almost falling shut entirely on its own. So that's really cool. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Anyways, thanks so much to Damn Designs for sending uh, these in for me to take a look at. Everything, all of this stuff from Damn Designs will likely uh, end up as, uh, you know, giveaway items at some point. So if you're not subscribed to my channel, uh, please subscribe. I do a lot of giveaways because I <laughs> just the nature of running a channel like this, you end up with a lot of stuff. And uh, I think it's fun to uh, give stuff away, especially as we approach the holiday season. So uh, anyways, guys, I think that's going to be pretty much it today. These were cool. Uh, we'll do a uh, we'll do a more detailed video down the road. Please scooch over there, guys. Please make sure to follow me, uh, on Instagram at metal underscore complex. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like. If you'd like to check out my other content, I do, of course, have lots of videos of knives are either expensive or inexpensive that I do or don't like, so check those out. And if you enjoy all my content, go ahead and click on that metal complex. logo right there and subscribe because there's definitely more coming. Thanks again for watching, everybody, and have a great day.